What's up everybody? So today I'm going to be talking about the brand new Halo 2 Vista client patch brought to you by the guys over at h2pc.org. Uh, this Halo 2 client patch will allow you to get the Halo 2 Xbox original ranking system and experience system uh, just like it was back in those days when Halo 2 was working on Xbox Live. So you'll be able to get the same uh, ranking and experience patterns you'll uh, always have to play to win because that's how it used to work back then and that's all it's about is about those wins so you'll be able to see those ex same exact experience system in Halo 2 Vista now. First of all I want to give a huge shout out to Super Sniper and Katanamo, uh, to the main programmers for the client patch they put a lot of time and effort into developing it and it is amazing it's awesome you guys are going to really enjoy it alright so let's get right to it um, if you already have Halo 2 installed on your computer, you have it up up and going, you've probably played a few games, then this is for you. Alright, so let's go ahead and get this going. Uh, go ahead and click on the htpc.org slash update link. You're going to be pre presented with a window just like this. There's going to be a link available to where you can download the H2 launcher, which is the client patch. And uh, go ahead and click on that. And then once you click and download it, you're going to be presented with this shark looking icon here. It's going to be called H2 launcher, aka H2 shark. Um, you're going to want to use H2 Shark to launch your game from now on out um, because if you don't launch it through Shark then you actually won't receive the client patch um, so if you know if you guys want those ranks and any other new features down the road you need to make sure you launch it through Shark so if you have any Halo 2 shortcut icons you click start to ser and search for Halo 2 to play it just get rid of those old habits and start using the uh, the Shark icon to, to do so because you need to use that in order to play from now on out alright so let's go ahead and open up Shark going to be presented this really small window you know it's pretty pretty short and simple um, you're going to see two buttons play game and activate and then if you click on settings you'll see enable Xbox field of view and there's going to be some other options there for you as well to be able to toggle um, for those of you who already have Halo 2 installed but just want to get that client patch rolling all you will need to do is click play game and then what you want to do is you want to click on register all right so um, I'm going to go in and click register and it says we're going to open the game and force it in the windowed mode so that you'll be able to see the shark window again um, right after. Alright, so it's going to go ahead and open the game up for me like so. I'm not going to do a complete registration as I've already registered my accounts but I'm just going to show you guys how it, the process pretty much works. Alright, so now I'm going to be signing into my Xbox Live Gamer Tag. Or Windows Live Gamer Tag, whichever you prefer to call it. And once you sign into your account, and you click sign in, or you know put in your password and whatnot, um, you're going to be presented with a window like this. And this window will uh, basically populate the same Windows Live ID email that's in this the first box in the game will show up in here. And then you're going to set a new password, and then you want to verify this password. Now this password has nothing to do with your gamer tag, so you can use a totally different uh, different password. But you need to make sure you use the same email because this is pretty much linking your gamer tag together to htpc.org, and you need that in order to receive the, the uh, client patch uh, ranking system, and as well as for stat tracking and features like that down the road. All right. So once you create your password and you verified your password. Go ahead and click on register, and then after that's going to say registration successful, and then you're going to um, close this out just so I can show you guys what's going to be next. And then after that, you're going to go back and open up the game again through launcher, and click play game. And this time, you want to just go and log in. And most cases, is already going to be populated with email and the password that you already created. Uh, if you don't want to remember, just uncheck the remember box, click login, login successful, OK. Um, now the game's going to start back up. And what you want to do now is you want to sign into the gamer tag that you pretty much logged into the HTPC. If you don't do that, you will get an error message saying that you need to sign into the HTPC account that is linked to this gamer tag pretty much. So um, make sure that you sign into the HTPC account or register first and then sign into the gamer tag that you need that you want to play with. Alright. Let's go ahead and sign into my account.
I should only be a few more seconds. Sometimes a little slow. Alright. Okay, so I'm going to proceed as normal. I'm going to live. Now I'm going to connect to a rank enabled server. The MLG servers are already rank enabled, so you should be able to connect to them and be able to retrieve your rank just like that. Okay. So now I've arrived into this lobby. Um, as you notice, the rank icon shows up, level 1, since it's the first time playing in here, and that's it. And once other players join, you'll see their rankings just as much, and you'll be pay uh, playing basically for experience. So, um, pretty huge deal. Once uh, we get some more systems up and running, we'll have the true emulated matchmaking system as we were talking about before. Um, it's not going to be entirely how matchmaking works back in those days because Halo 2 Vista did not, uh, never had it completely implemented. But um, you'll see down the road how we're going to really run it, and you guys will definitely enjoy it. Uh, being able to play those old classic playlists from o to, from 2007 on Halo 2 Xbox are going to be showing up on Halo 2 Vista. So not only will you be able to play those old school playlists like Double Team, Team Snipers, Team Skirmish, and even Team Hardcore, which will be basically MLG playlists, you'll also be able to compete for ranks. So guys definitely enjoy it. I'm going to go ahead and uh, quit out of this game now and go into a little bit of demonstration with activation. Alright, so at this point, um, if you already have the game up and running, you're pretty much good to go. Enjoy the client patch and rankings. This part uh, portion is going to be talking about activation part, okay? So um, for activation, you're going to need to have the game already installed. You're going to need to, which I'm going to bring this up to, um, you're going to need to have Games for Windows Live Marketplace inst client installed right here. You're going to need to have uTorrent installed or another torrent client in order to download the Halo 2 for Windows Vista torrent, which you need in order to play. Of course, if you have a physical copy, that will work just as fine too. I'm um, just going to be talking about the torrent since that's the one I used the last in the last videos that I made. You're also going to need WinRAR to extract the torrent file to a folder. And it's also an awesome program to have too. Um, when you get to WinRAR, make sure that you click the bit version of your Windows. So if you have a 64-bit Windows, you need to click x64. If you have a 32-bit Windows, you need to click x86 and download which one appropriately. All right. And also, you can go to my thread to follow along with the text guide. Um, that's going to help you, you know, just read along with it and go from there. Basically, you want to uh, you want to go ahead and open up startup.exe. You want to click on customize game install. Click on full install. Do not start. Um, if this is the very first time for you, you might get a product activation wizard. Go ahead and click activate later. Um, let the game go ahead and install. And once it says Halo 2 for Windows Vista has been successfully installed, click OK. Once you've done that and you have the Games for Windows Live client installed, and you've also downloaded H2 Launcher, or AKA H2 Sharp, because you're going to need that as well. Um, go ahead and start it up with Launcher. Okay, so now you're going to be presented with Play Game and Activate, just like the um, just like the first portion of this video. And what you want to do is you want to click on Activate this time to get your game copy activated. What this is going to do is Shark is going to open up your wind, uh, open up your game, and window mode again. And it's going to require you to sign into your live account. And it's going to generate a product key for you to use. Um, all you're going to do is literally copy the whole string of product key and then use Control V to paste the product key from the beginning box till it fills it up entirely and then click submit. And then momentarily, um, you're going to be able to play. Now, Shark is going to do things a little different. Um, instead of the game actually pushing the update out to you, Shark will actually take care of the update for you. So you'll actually get the latest Halo 2 Vista um, software update installed before you even start the game up. So you don't have to worry about those issues where people were having tr uh, having trouble with downloading the update. Shark will download the update for you and will install it before you even get the game rolling. So um, Shark will install the update and it will also get your game activated but you need to make sure that you have the game installed on the computer beforehand shark will not do that much for you once you've activated your copy um, that's pretty much it what you need to do um, you click done on the shark window and shark will close out halo 2 and then you would go ahead and click on play game and then register your account and do the same exact same thing we did in the beginning of the video where you register your account and then you log into your account and then you log into your live tag, and that's it. All right. So, um, just wanted 
through this brief video, guys, uh, to be able to help you guys uh, figure out how to run Shark. It's really simple. This client patch will make the process a lot simpler for you guys to install Halo 2. I know, understand the installation is a little tricky. Um, it should be a lot easier now, especially with the activation part. And the best thing is, is that you get ranks and you also get uh, new patches down the road as well, new f uh, features and fixes. So I um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you need any help, feel free to reach out to me on my B my thread on beyond.net, teambeyond.net, and or you can always reach me on Twitter at Yoshinja with two A's, and you can also reach me out on YouTube at the comments below. All right, guys, have a nice night.